Scott and Greg <laughs> here at Explore Scientific and we are going to show you how to install the Explore Stars app and how to install install the Explore Stars Celestial database for the PMC8 system. Yep. So we have a website it's called explorestars.com. That's where all the information about Explore Stars, uh, the application, the celestial data, the uh, P, uh, SDK software to download uh, the ASCOM driver, to mess with the open go to source code, all that stuff is available on explorestars.com. Uh, what we'll do first is show you how to load the application to operate the mount and then to add the celestial data. Uh, the reason we have to do this is uh, Microsoft app has a requirement that the app has to launch within 10 seconds. It, uh, load, not launch. has to load within 10 seconds. So this is after you download it and right. you have it on your, on your tablet. Uh, when you say uh, um, launch the application, it has to upload in 10 seconds or less. So, yeah. so, so what you basically do is go to explorestars.com and you'll see a little uh, series of uh, pictures above uh, on the top menu and there's one that says how to download and install, download the Explore Stars app, download the celestial data, and use with the PMC-8. So this is all the basic information you need to get going with the app and get going with the, uh, uh, the software to operate the Exos 2 GT with PMC-8 and the G11 with PMC-8. So we start with the downloading the Explore Stars app. It goes to the Microsoft App Store. Uh, and and then at the App Store, you'll basically just tell it you want to load the software. It's worth mentioning something about the Explore Star Celestial Database, or the data archive as we call it. The reason uh, that we split this part was not only so that the app could launch in under 10 seconds, the Explore Stars app could launch in under 10 seconds, but uh, we will be continually updating uh, the Explorer Stars Celestial Archives. We wanted it to be separate um, in that regard. Uh, there's pictures in there, there's descriptions and stuff, and as that gets improved or added to, or there's new objects or whatever, right. um, then um, uh, you know, we, can, we have the flexibility to do that. Uh, currently, there's over 70,000 objects right. in there, and that will continue to grow as uh, things go along. So. Sure, yeah, that's a good point. Yep. Uh, so the Celestial Object Database is back again on explorestars.com and you basically just hit the download the Celestial Database So button. once the uh, application or the data, Celestial Data is loaded, then there will be um, a uh, zip file on your hard drive uh, of your tablet or your phone or your PC and you'll basically just go to that. It's called Explore Stars um, Complete and you'll basically just take that and um, uncompress it. It's a zip file, so you'll uncompress it. And then in that will be a folder with four files, actually a folder and three files. And you'll take those files and you'll drag those into your pictures folder on your device. Okay, so now Greg's already downloaded the app. Uh, the Explore Stars app. He has put and unzipped the files from the Explore Stars database into the pictures folder. Um, and so now I'm just going to go over here and open up the Ex Explore Stars. And there we go. And we're connected uh, wirelessly to. And so I've dimmed the lights, uh, and you can see that we now have a connection. And I'm just going to pull down from the top here, and we're going to get this menu that's going to drop down. To the extreme right is a little uh, button that says L on it, and this loads the extra stars, and it's going to say, please wait. And once it's completely downloaded, then it's going to return back to its normal state, and all of your 70,000 plus objects from the Explore Stars database will be loaded in there. And now you can see that it's uh, resumed back to its normal state. And at this point, I can access um, other objects here. For instance, any of the constellations, um, Mercier objects in there, and about, again, over 70,000 objects are 
are uh, listed and a lot of them with pictures and text and um, it makes for a rich observing experience. So this concludes our explanation of how to install the ExploreStars app and how to load in the ExploreStars Celestial database. If you have any more questions, please get in touch with customer service at Explore Scientific at 866-252-3811 and one of our reps will be happy to help you. Keep looking up.